Oh, speaking of Hunger Games, though, because okay. I really dove into like all the old Hunger Games conspiracies. Uh -huh. Damn, there's hella. What? There's hella. So, do you ever hear the theory how Katniss Everdeen was the reason Prim got reaped? No, why? So, you know what reaping means, right? Yeah, like Where that. they choose who gets to go and fight in the games. Yeah, yeah. The theory goes that Katniss is the reason she was picked. Now, in the book and even in the movie, uh -huh. you know, she went to that one, like, it's a it's a black market where they sell trinkets and shit. Okay, yeah. And she got the Mockingjay pin. Mm -hmm. Now, the Mockingjay is the reason Prim was chosen because the pin resembles and it's a symbol for rebellion. Now, oh, no. theory goes that when they're deciding who to pick for the reaping, uh -huh. they seen her with the pin and decided to choose her to get rid of a rebel. What? Now, because the Mockingjay itself, the uh -huh. reason it's it's a, a rebellious symbol mm -hmm. is because, you know, the Jabber Jays, it was, it was those birds that can like copy voices and okay, shit. Yeah, yeah. The Mockingjay, it became like a natural thing where other birds, I'm pretty sure like real birds, they mm -hmm. ended up mating with the Jabber Jays and then it created the Mockingjay. Oh, so the shit. Mockingjay is an accidental thing. So it's like a sign of like rebellion. Yeah. And all of that shit led up to Prim being caught no. and then Prim being into the reaping and then now Katniss had to like, you yeah, know what I'm talking about? Fuck. <laughs> so just because she bought that trinket. Yeah, and gave it to her during the reaping. So she used that girl the whole time. Because remember, she was up in the tree and she was like, Katniss, Katniss. No, that's different. That's different. Oh, that's not Prim. Prim is her sister. Oh, okay. Yeah, Wait. yeah. Oh, okay, okay. No, no, Pr Prim's her sister, fam. Oh, okay. I I'm thinking about the black girl. You remember that? That's that's a rue. Rue, oh, that's okay. Rue. I'm thinking about the wrong person. Okay, I, I understand it now. Mm. Fuck. Okay, okay. There's another theory too. Yeah. Check this out. So... There's a there's a theory that the Hunger Games, the whole point of the games, is literally just to test the capabilities of all the districts to see if they could rebel. Check this out. Okay. So every year they have a Hunger Games, right? <laughs> and usually, who would win? The the number one, two, yeah. three districts, uh -huh. because they're they're bred to play the games, okay. and they're the richer states. Yeah, they had all the D's guys. <laughs> yeah, they had all the D's mans, right? Yeah. Now, whenever. And this is proved in the recent film, mm -hmm. the one that just came out. Whenever a tribute from one of the one of the poor districts win, mm -hmm. that's a sign a rebellion is happening or is about to happen. Oh. So in the movie that just came out, mm -hmm. when uh I think her name is freaking fuck, I forgot her exactly her name. But the main girl from District 12 won. Oh shit. There was a rebellion in the in the midst mm. like they were cooking up a rebellion they're ready to fight back yeah. now in katniss everdeen's games too she won she won and where's she from district 12. Damn. so it's a sign right away that if someone from the later districts win that means they're gonna start a rebellion because they're powerful they're strong enough and they're ready and resourceful enough yeah. to, to fight back against the capital. That's actually smart though for the government because that's the easy tell. Like, oh, yeah, it's, a, it's like a litmus <laughs> test. It's just yeah. Like, you know that shit we put in the acid? Oh fuck! Like <laughs> District Twelve. <laughs> Like all men's are betting. It's like uh, District 12 has like a, a negative something on it. Oh no, plus five thousand dollars on them. Yeah, and they won. Like what the fuck? Yeah, fam. <laughs> Shut everything down. Mm. There's also a theory. Yeah. There's also a theory that um, you know, Katniss fell in love with with Peter. Peter. Yeah, Peter. There's a theory that she wasn't actually in love with him. What happened was he she got hijacked. So you know how in in the last Hunger Games film uh -huh. where Peter gets brainwashed, okay, and he does he's not the same. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's kind of evil and shit, right? Okay. Theory goes that during the first Hunger Games where she got bit by the by the Jays and shit. Yeah. Not by the Jays, by the bees, the the hornets. Mm -hmm. The venom that was in her system made her think about Peter. And made her fall in love with him to play out that whole storyline where they like kissed under the rock and shit yeah oh okay so to trigger that shit all in her head fam now <sighs> and we know and we know that in in hunger games 2 mm. there were people in the team the game makers team yeah. that were rebellious that were rebellious and rebels that were pushing shit in her favor for her to win now the theory too yeah you know her her designer okay. Sina. yeah yeah and she, he was the one making like the dresses and shit. But every dress? single dress, it represented rebellion. What the? Now fuck? the theory goes that because in um, Catching Fire in the book specifically, it mm -hmm. says that if a tribute is really uh, sought after, people can people can actually buy you. Mm. They can they can spend their money to to have dibs on you. 
So the theory goes that Cinna, her designer, yeah. paid the capital money so he has dibs on her oh, so that he shit. can do whatever he wanted with her and he was able to make her into the representation or into the fucking symbol of rebellion. Nah, fuck that, bro. Into the Mockingjay. Nah, that's true love, bro. I, I, there's no bees inserting love toxins into Katniss, bro. That's that's pure bro, love, fam. You don't know, fam. No, you don't no. know. <laughs> that takes away so much of the story because that's it's supposed to be natural love and like, oh, Peter, remember I'm the uh, you you forget me and then she, she remembered. But like reading the book, yeah, she doesn't seem the type to really fall in love like that though. That's the, that's the reason like I believe it. Mm. That's the thing I that's why I think it's real because everybody kind of has like an archetype. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And she's not the she's a survivor. Yeah, fan. she's like a fuck like whatever's happening right now. Yeah, she's yeah. a survivor. She doesn't care about love and shit. Yeah, she true. cares about her family. Yes, mm -hmm. but you know I'm sure she would rather have like just survived. Yeah, yeah than yeah. think about him. But it was only until she was injected with all that shit. Yeah, that's when she started to fall in love. That's when she started to make decisions about him. <laughs> facts, facts. It's yeah. chemical crazy. Though. That is yeah. true. But no, you know there's what? also an, uh, an AI uh, movie coming out too. And uh, the parents didn't know. It was so crazy how they set it up. So they were attending like this AI movie. Yeah. And the parents were, all of them were sitting in the front rows, right? Mm. And each one of the kids came up on the screen. And the kids were like, hey, mom, hey, dad, did you know this is really not me? It's AI. But they took all my. It only takes one photo for me to do this. Oh, I seen this in the that, theater, right? right? Yeah, in yeah, the theater. yeah. And they showed like um, uh, they're like, oh, this is the, like the worst it can be, and they put up like a uh, porn with her her face on it and stuff like that. Do you really want this? And they were crying, fam. It was actually crazy. Mm. Like imagine, you, like if I had seen you up there saying the same shit. Holy fuck! That's what it is, though. That's what the yeah. future is, and and we all signed on to it type of thing. So it's did it's we? A, yeah, we did. Every single time you said accept uh, terms and agreement, oh, yeah. it's raps. Fuck. It's raps. You didn't read it. You didn't read it, bro. And I accepted at the, same, the cookies, fam. Yeah, and at the same time, too, like, you probably would still choose accept anyway. Yeah. Because if you want your Instagram and you want to connect with all these people, you better pr press accept or you're just not going to be on t technology in the first <laughs> place. You're not just going to even be using shit. Yeah. Because all of it's probably the same thing, folks. Mm -hmm. Even, like, the Siri. Yeah. Yo, they've been out of your voice, dog. Yeah. They've been out of your voice. And the new iOS. Nothing new. <laughs> the new iOS update, you can change Siri to your voice, which is weird because I don't know why anyone would want to talk to themselves. Yeah, but... that's weird. I'm going to change it like 50 cents. <laughs> yeah. Honestly, I haven't even put Siri on this phone yet. Good. I'm wondering if I should My shit's disabled. Not. My shit's disabled. It's disabled? I disabled it as soon as I... Because I was singing a song, right? Yeah. So I was like, Jumbo Ch I was singing Jumbo Chan Poppin' by Drake. And all of a sudden, I hear calling and then it called my ex by accident oh, and I was that's like, i'm like what the fuck what the fuck and she texts me right away yo bro you still miss me no I, <laughs> but as soon as I, as soon as i said that bro i just disabled yo, siri because how bad can you mess up that how can you say her name and mess up the lyrics like that it was not that's nothing crazy close. low key your phone knew yeah your phone has a mind of its own because yeah, it's ai cool. at this point feel me yeah and it's like oh how can i fuck with him today <laughs> yeah <fuck laughs> and, like every time you dropped your phone every time you smash your phone on the table <laughs> It's yo, yo, theory, yo, yo. This is funny. This is where all the people in the comments always say Carlos smashes his phone on the table yeah, every time. Do, Check this out. My phone broke. <laughs> no, yo, yeah, my iPhone 13. Yeah, shit, shit is busted. Like it keeps freezing. That's why because you keep smacking. It, it probably happens to smack it like this, bro. Oh, titanium. titanium. It's titanium. It's titanium. Oh, now there's a Fortnite theory. Fortnite. Oh shit. Check this shit out. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> so you know how Fortnite wants a. Fortnite OG and it's the OG map. Uh, yeah, yeah. So there's a theory that that map isn't actually OG Fortnite, but it's actually Fortnite in an alternate dimension. So it's what? not from this reality. Check this out. Cause uh, yeah, it, it's not. It's not the same. It's different. It's different, right? Yeah, yeah. So um, in what's that? What's that map with the farm? Uh, I don't know. Oh, sorry, I, sorry. What, what, what's what's the what's the farm spot? That's a. I fucking forget. Something but, fields, right? Fatal Fields? Fatal, Fatal Fields. Fields. Yeah, yeah. Check this out. So Fatal Fields, there's there's a there's a there's a building. There's like a, a farmhouse. Yeah, the big one. And it's not there on the map right now. There's subtle differences throughout like if you play it right now on, yeah, on the yeah, yeah. OG Fortnite, it's I know missing. What you're talking it's about. not there. I know what you're talking about. There's another one. There's another one. In um, Loot Lake? Yeah, Loot Lake is different too. Yeah. Now uh the loading screens. So the loading screens are actually OG Fortnite loading screens, but yeah. with different characters so they're oh. doing the same like points check this out 
Let me see. So for example, yeah. look, this is the OG oh, one and this is the one. So, so this is like a futuristic one. It's an alternate dimension. Yeah. Look, check this out. Let me see. So this is the, the Fatal Fields thing. Look, yeah, Loot Lu Lake, yeah, yeah. Loot Lake is very different. Different, too. different. Now theory goes. Uh -huh. The reason all of this happened is because of the Batman who laughs. You know who that is? What? So the Batman who laughs is actually Joker. Now, this whole comic and this whole character was made by Epic Games and Fortnite. Okay. Check this shit out. What I'm about fuck? to spill all the beans. This is what they're doing next season. No, so calm no, down. no. This guy's going to predict it. Watch. So the Batman who laughs, but I heard this from, uh, from other like yeah, people yeah. looking into it. Mm -hmm. The Batman who laughs, in the comic, he says, this is exact lines. He says, I've devoted my life to corrupting different universes. And with the zero point, the possibilities are infinite. Okay. So theory goes that he changed everything in Fortnite and he's manipulating the universes just like in Doctor Strange, just like in Loki. Oh. So he's playing like that Loki character. Also the symbolism with the time machine, you know, the trailer with the time machine and it takes them back into yeah, OG yeah, yeah, Fortnite. Yeah. You know how it's spread out like, like a web? Mm -hmm. And we all know that Marvel and Fortnite, they always work together. Oh. It literally looks exactly yeah. like the infinite like threads. Like uh, teleportation. In, in um, not even teleportation, the, uh -huh. the different dimensions, the webs, mm. the different strings of realities. Yeah. It represents that. Word. So Loki, they're just taking a, a chunk out of what's going on right now. Yeah. Bro, all of these different movies are doing multiversal things. Mm -hmm. You don't think Fortnite's gonna do it? Yeah, no, that 100%. They did it, bro. anime, they did everything. They did everything. Yeah. So now this is Fortnite's time to do alternate dimensions. And you know what they're gonna do? What? Check next. this shit out. Let me see. Here. This is what they're gonna do next. This is the perfect time to drop alternate dimension shit. Alternate dimension being first person mode on Fortnite. No. Yeah, fam. Yeah, bro. That's what they're dropping next. Watch. That would be so tough. Watch, bro. Because they know, they know a lot of players, they're going to Call of Duty, uh, yeah, yeah. Battle New Royale, and they're going to all of these different games like Apex that have the same Holy game mode, shit. but are first person. So this is the perfect time because of the alternate dimensions, the alternate realities to turn Fortnite into an alternate reality where it's first person. No, if they do that, that's so perfect because you have everything in that game now. Mm -hmm. Now, the theory is the whole yeah. reason they dropped Fortnite OG yeah. was because it was their last thread, fam. Oh, so shit. the theory goes that they would only bring back OG Fortnite if the company is on a downhill, which it, it was, was, it was, which it is was. was. Now, but for them to drop that big of a hit, mm -hmm. bringing OG Fortnite back, they'll only do it if they're going to drop something crazy next. So that the next true. season or whatever they're doing after, because what happens is when they drop OG Fortnite, mm -hmm. all eyes are on Fortnite. Everybody's back. Yes. Everybody's looking. So now that you have everybody's attention, you're ready to drop something huge. Yeah, so that makes so much sense. My theory, no. they're dropping first person Fortnite. No, I actually believe, no, I, that might not just For be a theory, sure, bro. Yeah. For sure. It's so perfect. Bro. It makes oh sense. It makes sense. Yeah. And like, you know, the there's an item. I don't know if it's new or old, mm -hmm. but it's called the Riff, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And a Riff, what it does, if you click um, R2, it transports you, like teleports you. Mm. So I don't know if that's also a hint into like the, the low-key like time travel and everything but that's a new item fam yeah it yeah. may be hinting to that too yeah because all of that shit what i love about fortnite there's actually yeah. a lot of lore there is there there's is a lot of lore there's even lore um you know that character midas midas he's, he's he's like the guy with the gold and shit everything he touches turns to gold oh no i don't know about so that guy. in in the recent season yeah yeah there's a character his name is the big guy that gives you all the things? No, no, no. There's oh, another okay. character. There's another character. His name is... His name is Nolan Chance. So Nolan. there's a character named Nolan Chance. Check this out. Nolan Chance in the Fortnite lore, yeah, yeah. he's supposed to be this mastermind thief. But okay. code word mastermind. The only person they ever called a mastermind was Midas. Now, mm. theory goes that in this OG Fortnite, Nolan Chance is actually Midas, but the younger version. Mm, this so it's is another him. play on like yeah this is him before he turned evil. into midas mm. because he was a great thief and thieves always want what oh. riches they want gold yeah and yeah. midas ended up being the person everything he touches turns to gold That's true. Damn. crazy the lore is actually pretty fire yeah no and i don't know why like that was a like you said the perfect time because 
uh, it went trending. Like you know that the thing where it's like a game drops something is like I'm bring we're bringing OG back. Yeah, and then every video on TikTok is don't talk to me on November the twelfth. You know mm. why? And then everyone's like why? And then there's a bunch of comments saying OG Fortnite and shit like that. Yeah, yeah. No, yo, if they do if they do first person, I, I'm telling you they're gonna do it. I'm but you. the whole point of Fortnite is to be a not first person shooting game though but that's the thing like for them to do the alternate dimension shit and say yeah. oh this is what do you mean this is what fortnite always was ah they oh, play that that's that so, so fire perfect. that's yeah. so fire <laughs> like story wise pr wise double and you know what they did <laughs> you know what they did too that i realized so they have uh two uh versions mm -hmm. it's og fortnite and og fortnite no build yeah no build so, yeah. so what i'm thinking is obviously they brought the og fortnite back but everyone on fortnite regardless of you bring in the og map is a sweat yeah like you'll have why. those mans like this is, this that's why i only play no build <laughs> Cause I'm trash. Real shit. No, real shit. So I'm like, that's so smart that they had two versions. Cause even the shitty players will mm -hmm. come back we to Fortnite. We can still play. We can yeah, still play. They're actually they're they're on top of it. Cause fam, you think you're nice until you play. Yeah. Oh my. Oh, no, it, it sucks. It sucks. Like it's not fun no more. Fam, you, know? you shoot at them once, they have a whole tower <laughs> constructed in one. She, she looks like a Lego game. Like, <laughs> holy fuck. And then I can't even do nothing. My character's just stuck. I'm like, no, as soon as as soon as they built that first one, I'm I already logged out the game, fam. I'm already on 2K. Fam. Yeah, facts. No, that's why they're super smart. So I think I think Fortnite, they're gonna drop that. Mm -hmm. They're gonna drop like the craziest collabs. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. you think about it, there's they dropped um this is this is new uh -huh. on their Twitter. They they put up a huge list of okay. all these different um celebrities brands fandoms yeah of things that people might be into and they said okay let us know which one you guys want us to collaborate with right. what's crazy about fortnite they can deadass collaborate with anyone they want you know who they had on the list yeah they had rick owens oh my gosh Damn, they, <laughs> with the rick Fort owens <laughs> yeah yo they can literally have everyone of any um uh, category playing their game like the yeah. emos the street kids you like can you can put anything my theory yeah i think this is way, way, way further into the future. Yeah. I think what they might do with Fortnite mm. is they're going to make it open. Open collaboration. So where you can build your own skin, your own packs oh, okay. and everything. Like Minecraft. Yeah, to pay and promote your stuff. Mm. So it becomes a thing of like, oh, let's go check. Because the Lewis Hamilton skin, Yeah, that was definitely just a PR move for them to push Lewis Hamilton. Mm. It's not because people really want a Lewis Hamilton skin. Yeah, yeah, no one wants You know what I mean? So uh, imagine where it becomes in the future, yeah. Fortnite, I'm not saying Fortnite's gonna die, but like mm -hmm. when they're not collaborating with the biggest of brands, they'll be looking at whoever and whoever, Yeah. anything. Like fam, they, they made Cabby Lame a skin, right? Ninja a skin. There's so many other like char characters, influencers that they made. They have the world still. Have anybody they want, bro. Yeah. They'll put blue clues in that shit. They put anything. <laughs>